my name is Kelly McElligott and I'm one of the educators here with Bywater Solutions and I have a short tutorial on a new enhancement with the 1611 Koha upgrade that allows you to make your previous serial available. The first thing the first thing to do is we do have a new system preference that's called make previous serial available. So we'll go over to our global system preferences and we'll go to make previous And this option allows you to make or do not make the previous serial automatically available when receiving a new serial issue. So this will be great for all those libraries that, that don't circulate their current issue of a subscription, but they circulate the back issues. This is telling me to please note that the item level iTypes system preference must be set to a specific item as well. So we'll go over and check our system preferences for item level. and that is set to a specific item. Another thing that we need to make sure is that we have two separate item types for, for subscription magazines. So a non-circulating periodical eye type and a circulating periodical eye type. So that is in our administration under item types. So you can see here I have a non-circulating periodical for an item type and I have a periodical. So the periodical would be the circulating one and the non-circulating periodical would be the one that's the current issue. So now that we have that set up, let's go ahead and look for a subscription in our, in our catalog that we need to start a subscription for and start receiving those magazines. So here we have Taunton's Fine Cooking and we're gonna go over and make a new subscription for that. This is something that if you have prior um, subscriptions in your catalog system, you can go ahead and edit those. I'm just gonna start new, fresh with this subscription. Another piece of information, you do need to create an item record when receiving the serial if you would like to make this system preference work. So you do need to have that create an item record when receiving the serial clicked. Then you would fill out this information for your library. You had a library designated, any public note, non-public notes, if there was a patron notification, the location in your library. This is new, so now it says item type and then item type for older issues. So your current, when you receive, you want your item type to be that non-circulating and then the item type for older issues will be your regular periodical. Go ahead and hit next. Now I'm going to start this subscription starting April 1st and this is a, a monthly magazine. Our subscription length is 24 months and I'm going to say we're going to start this subscription also April 1st. The numbering pattern on this magazine is just a number. And I'm holding issue 143, so that means my inner counter is 142. I can go ahead and test that prediction pattern and see that it looks like the numbers continue on, which is correct. Once I save the subscription, I'm going to go ahead and receive my first issue. Yep, issue number 143 is what I have in my hand and it has arrived. I'm going to fill out the pertinent information for this subscription for this magazine. Give it a barcode and I'm also going to put that non-circulating periodical in there. So we're, here we have it. We've received April 1st and the next one, May 1st, is expected. I'm going to go and show you what it looks like in the library catalog. And you can see that the item type non-circulating periodical is for that um, April 1st number 143 issue and that's not for loan. 
So now we're going to pop over to back to our subscription and receive another issue so we can see what happens to this April issue when we receive the May issue. We're going to go ahead and receive. I'm receiving my May 1st. It's arrived. Once again, I'm going to fill out my information that's necessary. I'm going to go ahead and save that. It's already letting me know that June's is expected. I'll pop back over to our um, catalog and see what it looks like. And now you can see that the, the April issue is now available and my May issue is not for loan. This video has been brought to you by Bywater Solutions. Thanks so much.